All right. Taking off this one and moving on to the next. On to the next. Let me just see something real quick. All right, I did not open these up. I gotta open these up. How am I gonna do that without any tools down here? Do I have something? Give me a second. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah, pin. There we go. There we go. Well, I don't really want to mess the box up, really. Yeah. Alright. Alright. Fly with the box. Riding with the box. It happens. That tape was. Is. On there. Don't mess the box up. There we go. There we go. One bit of sell these mugs because they're not my size, and I know that. Slide this box over. Different box mm -hmm. <laughs> for the adult size and for the car line. These mugs smelly smell, smelly smell. Man, in my own size, they look even better though. <laughs> I mean, well, this is not even my size, it's closer though. But anyway, I like this box. This box is dope. But anyway, these are size 9. I cannot fit a size 9. If I could, I would keep these probably. CT8529106 is the code. Oh, man. This would have been a nice little pad, a little pickup though. Icy bottoms. I don't think I really showed these shoes in that last video. These are adult sizes, the other ones were kids. Oh, man. Just look at them. Man, this part is going to stain so fast. That first time somebody dropped, you know, some ketchup on it. They've done. Done. So how the heck you going to get in there and clean that up? Might as well just get a new pair. Look at these though. If I were to sit on these for a while, I know they were, you know, at least 300, maybe by the end of the year. I know I'm like months late, though, as far as when these came out, I'm like months late, but I'm getting rid of them probably tomorrow. Put them up on a block, on the chopping board, and get rid of these, let somebody get them. You guys are getting your little steamies pretty soon, I'm pretty sure. Steamy chicks are coming, so hey. I'm gonna get rid of these while the steamy chicks are out there. All this new found money. Bottoms. Again, bottoms. You have to run. This is like the tightest part of the shoe right here. I don't know why. To me, anyway. I forgot what that's like. I forgot what that was for. I like it though. That's a good um, addition to the shoe. It's different. And it also helps you put on the shoe. Go like that. Lace locks. Lace locks. I don't even know these lace locks said Nike on them. You can see that. Nike was trying to really keep the Jordan brand separate during these days, I guess. Well, next, they should have been, you know, just see. 
it should have been just putting Jordan on the back. See, I don't care if it has Jordan on the back or Nike on the back, but he should have separated himself a long time ago. Before, like, after he, after the ones, they should have just kept. Like, this is going to be this guy's signature shoe to push us forward. I, but I guess it worked out. What they did worked, evidently. What? Who am I? Said it didn't. I, I know it worked. Hey, it's okay. But if I were you, when I get these, if you can only if you can find some stuff to go with this colorway, because it's like a scarlet. These carmine. These carmines like a scarlet. I could swear the other ones were like more. More red, red. Why don't you call that fire red or whatever? I don't know what you call that. But, man, see, we just not moving like this because it's cold. Indiana weather is cold. And I would turn my heat back on, but my house is 72. Doesn't make any sense turning heat on when your house is 72. So well, the air is set to 72. And if it, the weather jumps too much, because I'm telling you, telling you about four days ago i think or so it was like 90 degrees outside the day after i think it went to like 70 60 or 75 i don't know what's going on it's global warming don't know don't know i wish i did know kind of it's the craziest thing but anyway let me talk about shoes I'm selling these, and I'm going to be buying some stock with it. I'm going to try to get 100 shares of Nike stock is my goal. 100 shares. How many of you can do that without, you know, having to sell shoes? I can't. I mean, I can, but why well, have all these shoes if you're not wearing them? If I can make my shoes make me make money, or if I can have Nike paying me to buy, well, to buy their shares of stock, and then buying those shares of stock could one day buy me the shoes that I want to buy, hey, win-win for both. I should have been doing this a long time ago. I don't know why I didn't think of it. I, I should have picked one stock years ago. One stock for this and for different sectors of things that I like. And went with that and just went all in. And all went folded, just went all in on those certain sectors and things. Man, I know I have over 10,000 shares of Nike stock right now. Easy. Easy would have over 10,000 shares. Just want to smack myself right now for that. Bands. Bands, man, then the shoe, then the, then the share, the, the dividends from the Nike stock would have been able to afford me shoes every year. I wouldn't have to spend my own cash money for the shoes. <sighs> Playing the wrong game. Playing the wrong game. Playing the wrong game. But, hey, now let's get that 100 shares probably by this time next year. I have it. I'd be happy about that. Anyway, you guys, have a nice day.